Hello everyone, good morning, and welcome here back to my channel. I thought today would be really fun um, just to kind of take you guys through everything that I do on a Sunday just to kind of prepare me for the week ahead. So um, yeah, I just thought that this would be kind of like a different um, look into how I organize my life and get it all together. It's not always perfect and things don't always go to plan, but you can always have the best intention <laughs> and try your hardest. So I thought that's what we'd do today. Um, hopefully you guys enjoy. I love these videos. They just make me so happy. I don't know. I love just peaceful like organization, getting things done, ticking off a to-do list. Like I love things like that. So I thought I would do one. And if you guys do enjoy, hit that subscribe button. We are so close to a thousand. I say that every single video because it's true. Like every time I get a new subscriber, it gets me closer and closer. But we are so so close that it actually makes me so nervous and I'm also planning a very fun giveaway so once I hit a thousand subscribers I'll hopefully have talked more about this on my Instagram before this video is up Ooh, actually maybe not I don't know <laughs> um hopefully I will but uh, yeah, I'm planning a very fun giveaway for when I hit a thousand subscribers just to thank you guys for the support and the love um, So definitely make sure you are subscribed and then the next video we'll talk a little bit more about how to enter but um Anyway, without further ado, we are gonna get off to the store. Um, that is one thing I love to do. I love going grocery shopping. I do it every single week. And if you guys wanna see like how I plan out my meals and how I plan out what I'm gonna get at the grocery store, I've done a video in the past um, and I still do the same method. Um, so I can link that here or down below for you if you want to check it out and essentially it's just like shopping in your pantry before you shop at the store so based off what we already have left over from last week I created a new meal plan and there's just like stuff that we always have to get like new snacks and just things to kind of keep us uh, good throughout the week uh, my husband Sebastian works at home so I have to have lots of goodies for him. So anyway, we're gonna go to the store and then I'm actually so excited. Sebastian was like, yesterday, he was like, baby, like my skin, I don't know what's wrong with it. And he doesn't have a skincare routine. It drives me nuts. But he was like, I would love for you to just go to Sephora and get me what I need. And I was like, okay, uh, I will do that. <laughs> so I told him, I was like, be ready to pay like $100 Bless. Um, but I've been doing all my research. Luckily, like skincare isn't gender specific, so that's a great thing. But it's hard because I don't really like know his. I mean, I know his skin, but I don't like know how it's going to do with these products. So I'm gonna. I've done some research and just kind of mapped out a good skincare routine. I've added some Jonathan Van Ness products <laughs> that he uses into my baby's skincare, and I'm just gonna get him like four things I want to get him like a nighttime and morning moisturizer with some SPF he doesn't wear SPF which kills me and then a serum and a cleanser um, but he also wanted body lotion <laughs> bless him so yeah we're gonna get some fun things so yeah tangent over let's go to Trader Joe's and then I'm gonna hit up Costco I don't always go to Costco every single week um, it just depends on what we run out of I'm gonna turn off my car what we run out of so I think when people think of like Costco especially if you're just in like a two-person family like me and Sebastian it can feel like a waste or why would you go there but honestly we get all of our frozen chicken there I love it it's such a great deal there's great chicken we get all of our cleaning and like household items so um like wipes or cleaning sprays or detergents and stuff like that so stuff that like isn't the produce I think when you think Costco it's like great produce and stuff that you might not be able to use up in time um, but we just get the things that are great value for our money and that can last a long time that we don't have to like run through within a week so that's why I go to Costco I can show you guys a little bit of what I get there just to give you guys an idea it's not a ton actually there's just a couple things that we need from there and then Trader Joe's I'm gonna hit up Trader Joe's I I love it I'm back on my Trader Joe's love I was going to like Smith's for a while and I do love them but something about Trader Joe's just brings me back so let's get on the road okay so now that we are home from the store now we gotta put it all away. And one thing that I really love to do weekly is clean out our fridge just before I put any new stuff into it just because it's relatively like 
clean. It just has like leftovers from the week or I don't know, stuff that just like isn't good anymore that we need to get out. So before I put any of my new stuff away, um, I'll go in and just quickly give the fridge a little bit of love. Just makes me feel better knowing that like it's clean. Another thing that I will do with like salad and stuff like this, this is kale. So with any spinach or kale that's in the fridge that we tried to get through fresh um, through the week, if we don't get through it, then I'll just throw it in a big Ziploc bag and then stick it in our freezer. Um, that way we can like put it into smoothies and still get use out of it. Now we have a nice organized clean fridge with all of our fresh produce, new snacky bits, drinks, stuff like that. Another thing that always has to get done and that feels really good to do is to wash your sheets and gonna be super real <laughs> have not washed these sheets since we've gotten them which is so horrible I know just being honest and so yeah um so I'm gonna clean all of our sheets it just makes you feel so good getting into a nice clean bed with new sheets we are actually going to buy a whole new like duvet cover just because the one that we have is so like amazing and fuzzy and warm, but Sebastian runs like really hot. So <laughs> he's over it and I just don't want to have to like deal with like washing it anymore. I don't know. It's just like it's overwhelming. So we're just going to get like a normal one. Um, so that will be exciting. So I want to make sure that we have like nice um, clean sheets by the time that one comes through. <laughs> Something that I have been wanting to try for such a long time is getting eucalyptus and putting it in my shower so that when the water um, steams, it smells like eucalyptus and it's very spa and relaxing. So I'm actually really excited to try it. Um, so it's just like tied up there. We'll see how it goes. I'm in my bathroom because a lot of the things that I like to do before a busy week is just like sure everything is like set where it needs to be, refilled, kind of all of that stuff. And one thing that I love doing, not every week because there's no need to, but every couple weeks I change the head of my razor. So this is just the Flamingo razor at um, Target. And and I actually love them. I have been repurchasing this for a while and I really love it. So I just get like the little replacement heads and every few weeks I will change that out just so, oh, maybe, um, just so I'm not like shaving with a dull razor. So that, so I will do that. And then a, another thing, uh, me and Sebastian have been taking baths together every single night and like reading our book and it's just been so fun and such a nice way to just like decompress and spend some time together and so we ran out of all of our bath salts so I love doing like a bubble bath with bath salts and a bath bomb and all that stuff making it feel like really luxurious and so I found these ones at TJ Maxx no where was I home goods <laughs> I was at home goods um and I thought I would give them a try they were just like the stress less um, blend and so I really love to put them in this little container and just keep it on the side of my tub you could obviously just leave it in this this is like not necessary but I just really think it's pretty to have them in there and they just like easily dump into the tub um, so I'm gonna refill this so that's ready for us during the week um, because yeah it's just been our new favorite thing to take little tubs together So while the laundry is still going on and 
um, I'm kind of like taking a break from work and all that stuff, I will fit in a workout. So this is something that I like to do any day that I can, not only on the days where I'm trying to prepare for the week, um, but especially on a slower day like today when I don't have a lot to do. It's nice to kind of get in a workout during the afternoon. And so I actually have on my swimsuit because me and Sebastian are training for a triathlon sprint. So it's like the easier version of a triathlon. Still very difficult and challenging, but so I've been training and swimming has just honestly been so difficult. It's been so funny of how hard it has been for me to just like, I knew it was gonna be hard, but it's just like the breathing aspect that's very difficult, not just like the stamina and like how tired you get. Um, so I'm working on that. So that's what I'm gonna go do. I'm gonna go to the gym and go swim. Sebastian's already there. Um, so I'm gonna go meet him and yeah, that's why I have my swimsuit on. But I just thought I would let you guys know. Um, this is a goal that I've wanted to achieve and hit for, uh, I wouldn't say like a while, but Sebastian kind of talked me into it, and so now I'm excited, and it's something that I'm working towards, so we'll see how we get on with that, but um, yeah, I'm gonna run to the gym. The laundry's still going, so it's nice to kind of multitask, have things working for you, <laughs> um, like the laundry, and then yeah, we'll get back here and just get back to sorting out the house. I'll see you guys after my swim. <laughs> Pool it was great. It's so fun swimming. I always am like scared to start swimming and then when I swim I have so much fun. <laughs> so we're home from the gym and I just showered and washed my hair and that's something that I'll do every single Sunday um, or at the start of the week just to kind of take me through <laughs> the rest of the week because I don't wash my hair every single day. Um, but yeah, I thought I would, as I was washing my hair, I thought I would show some of the shower products that I use. and. Um, Cause yeah, some new things, some things I'm loving a lot that I thought I would share with you guys. And it's just another thing that I do to help me prep for the week. So this is the shower scrub that I got from Trader Joe's. It's the grapefruit ginger and I love shower scrubs. So I thought I would try a different one other than my Dove body polish that I love so much. Um, but I like this one. It's really nice. It is a very like scrubby texture i know that sounds silly but like the dove one is very like scrubby but like silky and so kind of creamy where this one is just very like scrub but very refreshing i love anything grapefruit so that was nice and then for shampoo i always use the kristen s this is the signature shampoo and i really love it i am going to be dyeing my hair again just because i cannot keep up with the blonde i don't like it anymore and i don't like having like specific shampoos for blonde hair like I just do not like it so this is great if you don't have any like blonde in your hair <laughs> um, so it's not the best for me like right now but I am gonna be dyeing my hair so it's fine and then I got this and also their like mint um, scalp scrub from Briogeo I got it from oh it's not gonna focus this is a deep conditioning mask and I got this and the like um, I don't know what it's called. It's like a shampoo, but it's like a scalp treatment. So I got that one and this one, and I tried the conditioner today, and I actually loved it. I wanna get better at using hair masks because I just don't really bother with them too much, but I've heard a lot of great things about Briogeo, so um, I'm glad I got this little tester because I really enjoyed it. So um, I wanna get better about hair masks, so let me know if there's a good one. Yeah, we're gonna get ready for the rest of the day and I'm going to make my little casserole. I don't know why, I just really wanted like a yummy vegetable casserole. So I'm gonna make that and then we are gonna run to, um, I probably told you this, but we're running to Ross to get a new bedspread <laughs> because Sebastian hates it. I'm gonna go blow dry my hair and get ready for the rest of the day. Okay, I <laughs> have my computer now. It's been a couple hours and um, we went to Target and Ross and was able, well, we didn't find anything at Ross, which I kind of knew that we weren't going to, but we found our bedspread at Target. So win for us. I can show you guys a little bit later, but um, it is almost seven o'clock now and a huge part of my night and every single night is YouTube and editing, replying to comments, um, creating new videos, kind of all that stuff. Um, that is like what fills my nights. And so 
that is what I'm doing. <laughs> um, so I thought I would just like grab uh, the camera and just kind of let you guys know what I'm doing. This might be really ugly and hard to see because my screen is just like ugly. But anyway, um, I'm just, yeah, like replying to comments and back here I have a video exporting that is going up tonight. Um, so yeah, uh, just a peek into my night because that is what I have to do. And it's just nice, like, at the end of a weekend just to kind of look at my YouTube, see where I'm at, um, see what videos are coming up, and um, get ready to film those. I film a lot of videos on the weekends, but then I also film during the week as well. So it kind of just depends. Um, but yeah, that is what I'm going to do for a little bit. I have a thing of hot chocolate because I was feeling sorry for myself that I had to come up here and finish this video. Even though YouTube is what I love to do, sometimes you're just like so, I just wanna sit on the couch and do nothing, you know? But like, you don't get anywhere if you don't put in the work. So um, I made myself a hot chocolate and I'm up here, finished the video, have it scheduled out. I feel really good about it. Um, but I have to finish this before we go make dinner and yeah. So anyway, I can show you my best friend. I'm just trying to do anything to not edit anymore. Special's watching a base, a baseball, a basketball game. This is our new bedspread. So just went with this really pretty cream and like these little lines are blue lines because we do have this like blue rug. I really want to get some like throw pillows and like eventually take away our little pillow pet. But anyway, that's our new bedspread. I also picked up these new shorts from target aren't they so cute they also have these in pants as well so run and get these because they are so soft look at all my laundry um they're so so soft and like i said they're super cute um but yeah ignore the laundry i'm going to try to get this done in the next oh cutting myself off in six minutes and then we'll be ready for dinner because i'm kind of starving <laughs> So it is bedtime now and one of the last things that I will do to get ready for the night is fill up my big thing of water. Um, I have a little bit before I go to bed, um, but mostly I have it filled up for in the morning when I wake up and, and then I will drink that water throughout the morning. And then lastly, before I go to bed, I will just do some reading. So I'm going to read a chapter and then I will be off to bed. So um, I hope that you guys enjoyed seeing how I get myself ready. Um, I did clean the kitchen. I forgot to film that because <laughs> I was like too in the moment, but I always do the dishes before we go to bed. And yeah, I was able to do laundry today, the grocery store, my video. It was just nice to kind of get everything in order. Sometimes I pick out my outfit. Tonight, I didn't really even bother because I don't really struggle too much. There's sometimes like, I go through phases. Sometimes like I can never know what I'm gonna wear and like, tonight I'm just not really worried about it so um yeah I'm going to sign off for tonight I hope that you guys enjoyed this video hopefully it gave you some inspiration um as to what you can do to make your nights easier so that your mornings are easier and definitely subscribe if you enjoyed and I will see you guys in my next one bye